Hey guys, what is going on? This is Locknock1 slash Gubatic, and welcome back to part 7 of my Civilization Beyond Earth Let's Play. Uh, last time, we only got a little bit done, that's alright. Um, we, you know, as you get farther into the game, the turns slow down, etc. This siege room has been a problem for us. I want to get out some gunners, um, soonish. In the meantime, I want to improve this road and see if we can do it before the siege room tries to close in on us and rickety rickety wreck us. Um, until then, we do have some work for these tack jets. Let's heal them up real quick. And, you know, I could probably just start assaulting these aliens, but I would like to start the assault on the mana core. Um, because starting an assault on the melee unit, letting the range unit just sit on by, probably not the best tactical choice. Now, we do have a lot of tiles we want to improve and just not enough workers to do it. So... I'm thinking there's not totally a downside to a bunch of worker spam right now. Um, yeah, in fact, I hold that in high regard. Let's get three new workers out. I could do one here, maybe one here. Improve Tiangong as fast as we can. Because honestly, this is the cause of a lot of our unhealth. Two at the moment. Um, and I'd really like to get Tiangong growing again. Because it has been in kind of like a, I don't know what growth is, state for like the last while now. Um, let's pick up a recycler. It's better in the long run. Um... Yeah, not much else I can say. It's not growing at all right now. Uh, we could get trade routes out there and hopefully give it a little bit of something. In fact, I don't see anything against that other than this thing going around and murking everyone. Ah, uh, jeez, we should kill that. We should kill that early. It's going to give us a bunch of science. And honestly, we just need maybe two gunners to do it, so... Ugh, I'll prioritize it above two of the workers and I'll leave one there. I'd really like to get biowells up. I'd like to get the frac set up so I can build an observatory. There's a bunch of stuff one worker alone could do down there. Nope, we don't do war. Not until we are empire ready, sir. Um, the Brazilians can sit around dirtling. We're still above them, I believe. And he just moved up. We're still above him a little bit. Well, he at least... Okay, now you're eating him. Alright, I, I see how you work. Thanks, uh, th thank, thanks, aliens. You're, you're real, real nice guys. So yeah, city pound the worm when you can. Nothing wrong with that. Actually, Gansrig should be back up, get our energy back. Um, I'm looking forward to hitting level three. Our energy will come back. So I'm gonna heal these attack jets up just a little bit more so we can start hitting these units again. Do I have any use for this explorer? Honestly, no. And I don't see another quest coming for him for a very long time, so let's just disband it. Give us two energy back. And let's just pound that. And that'll give us a little bit of science, I suppose. Ten. It's not bad. Alright, so we got three biowalls up now. Um, so our economy's taking a small hit, I suppose. Uh, I think we've done enough in Kuyan. We've given it a lot of biowells, we're about to give it some farm food there. Honestly, I could lock all these tiles in if I want to. And that is gonna just that's just huge growth. Lovely. Um we could put another petroleum well. I think it is probably smart now to build a road to Huanlei. Or we could go and do the thing. No, we're getting workers out in Tiangong just for that express purpose. So yeah, let's just go ahead and build a road. Let us build bridges, brother. Where's this? Okay. Back to Jinsoku Labs. You know, it's for all that 50 plus 50 percent, I didn't really see that much of an improvement. That's still an amazing yield. Come get me, bro. These are veterans you're talking about. You're just not gonna take them down like that. I am two tiles within this thing, uh, within the radius of this. Xenomass, but they're not going to do anything about it because they can't fly over this ridge unless a drone comes overhead. Let's just get him out of that, though. Oh boy, oh. Um, yep, yeah, I'm not opposed to just pounding this thing until it's done diddly dead. Let's just go ahead and put him in defense position, defense mode, and uh, keep on hitting. You know, I'm really bad at these timers. Like, horrendously bad. It's a bit of a longer episode, don't blame me. Well, you can blame me, but I mean, whatever. Don't. That's mean. Get good, Raptor Bug. 
Alright. So let's go ahead and build it like... How do I actually want to build this road? One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five. Uh, it is five that way. Is that better? Maybe? I mean, that would just put making it a ten kind of this off-world thing. Um, one, two, three, four, five. Oh, you can do five here. All right. Um, this just seems better, even though it's longer. No, might as well just go this way. They're going to be free soon anyways. Um, right, we did get a recycler done in Ganzerig. Because it's actually a relatively improved city. So let's go ahead and grab the Vivarium now, because I'd like it to start growing, even though we currently haven't solved our health issue. Um, in the long run, again, what's going to solve our issue, health issue is just have a bunch of bat cities and pick up some virtues to deal with that on health. So we got another worker that's done here. Again, I say what we do is we just go down this way and get to work on this road to Huanlei. We got another worker. Wonderful. All right, so what I want to do with him is... Probably priority improve that Fraxite mine. Uh, it's going to take a while. We do have to remove the Miasma for our worker to survive that mine. And we're doing some good work on this Siege Worm. And yet, this, was, this city's just extracting science. That's all this city's good for. Wonderful, I love it. So just give me a little precious science. Mmm, mmm, 10 science. Beautiful. Yes, brilliant. I love how this is... No, I'm not, not even going to complain. Whatever. Alright, so this is basically why you pick up the petrochemical plant. Because this is this is cool. This is good, I guess. But this is... Just give me production, please. Yes, I accept. Alright, so now we're getting... More production out of each petroleum tile. Um, at least on... Oh, you know, yeah. Even on Tundra. This is just a cool tile now. It's just giving us more energy than it's actually taking. Finally given a nice chunk of production. Is the city working it? It better be. That's just a nice tile. And after we uh, pick up the Might Virtue that improves it, it'll just be even better. Let's get him up there. And get him into position for these roads. <coughs> Woo! Coffin. All day, all night. So, Ninotin is at 6. Thanks. No, well, don't, nope. Feet. We don't do that. It's not how we operate. You fool! Mm, give me your science. I will extract it from your dead body that I blew up with missiles. That's how that works. 8. How dare you. Alright, so we did finally get our next virtue. And the options we can go community medicine, which helps us a little bit, or we can go meme web, which will help us get our next virtue even faster. Um, I'm honestly a, in large favor of this, because again, I don't think this is going to do that much until we really get rolling. So, meme web it is. We are three away from getting that juicy, juicy plus 10 science. Let's get him back in the city to heal up, and have him begin to clear the miasma. So, you know, we didn't actually ever clear the miasma down here, so a nest could come back. So I suppose we could send this guy down to try to stop that. I really would not like that. It's just going to cause us issues in the long run. Um, let's build another road. We should be getting our first ranger soon. We just got our first ranger. Wonderful. So now we can... Oh, this is just, uh, alright. Just do more damage than he has health. Hmm, you know, we could try to take up this thing once and for all, and it would actually allow us a path in through here. And a city over here would not be bad. It would put us a little bit at odds with, you know, the Brazilians, but... I don't know. Right now, I'd like to just kill that worm. It's a bit of a priority. So once we have level 3, I guess I could just build a road from here to here. No real downside. Just allows a little more connectivity. Okay, so let's actually send him... Screw it, let's go this way. 
We're gonna hit three in seven turns anyways. Alrighty, let's keep on bombing. So I'm gonna do... Cross my fingers and hope not to die. But let's just walk on in. Alright, so we actually got a sight of this place. There's a nice resource spot up here and a 10 Xenomass nest up there. Oh, buddy. Um, thankfully, I don't think any of these guys can actually even attack the Marine this turn after I kill this guy. With the attack jets. Let's send him up north. You know, I really just want to clear this. I don't want a nest coming back. Just a waste of my time. Um, actually, do I want a nest coming back? That could be a bit of science. No more than a turn science at this point, though, in this game. So, you know, it's probably not worth it. Uh, let's just keep on going with biowells. Minute 10 continues to grow. My life continues to get better. Please focus the growth, because I need it. Alrighty. Uh, Minute 10 is at 6 now. We are still fine as far as local city health is. I wonder if we'll have to add this out of nursery at 7. Um, I think time it is now high time for the auto plant. Yeah, we'll be getting our auto plant queen in one turn. So this is our tr glorious triumvirate of cities. Um, Venga. Well, well, yeah, this was in the past. Ricos. Yeah, I'm still chill with that. I don't really have any uses Bonse. for petroleum right now. It's all good. Okay, so got, let's go ahead and remove that miasma. And this guy can go up north as well. Yep, we're going to clear out that nest if we can. Try to get our worm kill if we can as well. Oh, they're, they're pissed. That's alright. Our guy is completely safe where he is. Attack jets and the city basically defend him. See, this city's just milking science. Uh, these aliens. It's wonderful. It's just healing up. It's just doing us good in the long run. Okay, I... Mm, yeah, we're just gonna remove the miasma. It's just too much of a hassle. Okay, um... Finish the auto plant, so now everything's a bit faster in Kuyan here, even though we are working pretty much all of our food sources. Let's work that one, too. Um... That slowed down this a bit, but it upped our food even more. I just love the glorious food. Uh, this is odd. We actually have our five local city health, even though we don't have the pharma labs up. wonder how we did that one. Um, let's just... Oh, the bio wells. Durr. Um, let's just... See, bio wells have a use. They're cool. Let's just... Um, hmm, I think this is the best option right now. Or we could go network. It's a bit of nice science. I really like the culture, though. And, you know, this is going to quest very nicely into a science, uh, energy, and culture building, which is quite good. Venga. All right, well, so he wants more. Yep, yeah, we're good. All right, so let's... That was just me sitting with my roommate. How long? Uh, he could get back. In the room. It doesn't matter, does it? All right, let's keep on bombing. They're, they're trying to get to me. But I'm just gonna sit there and bomb away at tech jets, with tech jets as they enter the radius. It's sometimes nice to know how the AI works with the aliens, but they're just gonna get pissed off the second they come in that radius. Okay, so this guy, I suppose we could just have him go out and beat up this dude. And our, you know, our path to Wanlei will be done. In a short time. Right, so we did get another guy here. So now we can start improving both of these. That Xenomass will not be creating nests anymore. And we get to bomb another one of them. The AI doesn't learn. Yay! Keep on bombing. I'll probably move in for a kill now. Uh, knowing the rate at which the back jets and the gunners are here now. Well, they will. This, yeah, this one's here now. Um, should be fine. I suppose it's safe. So let's just build a bio well here, and that'll really help Ganser. I got a fair bit. As soon as we're done with our workers, I'd really like to get back to trade routes from Tiantong.
Yep, they're coming for me. They're not going to be too, too successful. We are damaging as they come. Uh, not the, you know, hmm. Let's actually pull this guy out. Um, and we could get him back into friendly territory. As is, I kind of just want to sit here and gun stuff. Let's train these guys. Um, and we can start bombing these guys, I suppose. No downside, just our science a little bit faster and helps clear out the aliens a bit faster. Looks like we finished something in Gongrun, probably the trade route. Uh, we finished a worker in the capital. And let's go alien preserve, actually, because I wanted to get that up. Because of the juicy, juicy yields. Um, and let's go with a bio well. This is ton you know what? Actually, I want to do something that is really you can only do with a bio well, which is build it on a forest. Because I love the yields that you get out of forest bio wells. Um, this one's gonna clear the miasma and see if he can't build a bio well there. So we are relatively negative with the energy, but it's okay. We do have a bit of a stockpile, and we can start building a thorium reactors to really reduce that to uh, or bring that back up to a positive number, I suppose. We did finish our vivarium. Um, Genzerig is growing at a nice pace now, so I think the best option is to just build a clinic. Um, it'll start reducing that unhealth, and we will be working towards our goal. Alright, so the trade depot's down. I think it's time to go recycler. Honestly, Gongren is going to have the longest term troubles. Um, with food growth and all, eventually we'll get it, uh, as soon as we can really get nice fat cities and pick up that virtue to reduce our unhealth. And our connection to Juanle is complete. That's going to account for some of that negative energy. And in three turns, our energy is going to jump up a fair bit. Because suddenly, all of these roads are going to be free. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. You get the point. A lot of energy. Um, which is beautiful. All right, so let's go ahead and see if we can pick up some food around here. So if we built a bio well here, it would just produce a four food... That's it. It'll just be for food, because the energy will actually counteract the bio well. Um, that's pretty cool. So let's build on that chitin, and let's build. We'll do that next turn. Wanle is going to be a really cool city. I love desert floodplains. When even you, when even when you only have two tiles of it, it's glorious. Which means it's going to grow that much faster than every other city in the game. This is sort of what I thought would happen. They'd both close in around this marine in the middle. Ooh, I guess he can just sit tight. He's not actually healing. Um, and both of these rangers have open room to fire. Yep, that's going to help train them. Give us a bit of extra science. The attack jets can s finish up. Well, I guess that one is weaker. So let's uh, always choose the strongest one. This is probably not going to incur very much damage at all in the attack jet. But I guess it's good. Let's heal this one up. Alright, so let's get a paddock here. And him. Let's get a bio well. Love me some bio wells. Bio wells are great because you grow and at the same time you're getting health to counteract your growth. They're just a wonderful, wonderful building. Alright, so what I wanted to do here was the That's right, the forest bio well, which is just a such a cool improvement because it becomes a food and production tile. And you don't have to remove the forest, which is wonderful. When provided with adequate data and field of view, anyone can predict the future. Progress begins with someone saying, there has to be a better way to do this. So pretty much instantly, our energy jumped up. Um, that is because we now have, uh, what do you call it? The free roads and magrails. So I'm thinking right now, what we do is we go tactical robotics, then pick up Cognition and start to build our Neural Labs and our Hollow Suites. From there, we go to Fabrication and pick up this. Uh, sorry, we built, start building Mag Rails everywhere. That's going to help out quite a bit. Um, alternatively, you know, health is not going to be an issue now that we have the Bio Wells. Um, in the long run, you know, we haven't decided really where to use our Institute, the Free Tech. I love to get the Free Tech from the Institute because it can save massive time on amazing techs like Social Dynamics here. I honestly think Social Dynamics is probably one of the better choices for Supremacy builds, because like I said, 
Uh, food is going to be a major issue, and the Civil Crash is one of the only affinity neutral options, really, for growth. So, if we time this right, we could do everything pretty optimally. What I mean by that is we go... We could go Cognition first, pick up the fourth Supremacy thing, so the Neural Labs come online, and then hope to get our Free Institute quest once we've got Cognition. It'll jump us straight to the Civil Crash. Um, that's not a horrible option. Or we could go Tactical Robotics, Cognition, and then Social Dynamics. While we're at it, we will have CNDRs. Uh, we could build those if we need them. We probably won't need them. Uh, because if you can kind of go without needing to fight until 6, you're just kind of a lot better off. Alright, um, let's go Tactical Robotics, and then we'll try to see if we can pick up Cognition. I think that's the safest. And we'll build our Institute... Uh, I guess as soon as we get Tackle Robotics done, maybe. Um, Alright, so the choice is Fortified or Flanking. I like the Flanking. Um, honestly, just because it's not that often that you run into AI that are Fortifying. It's a different thing when you're wondering about what you ought to do in a multiplayer game. There are Tech Jets on a rollin'. You know, we're just exterminating these aliens faster than they can spawn, which is really the goal. And they're giving us glorious, glorious science. This is not really going to take us 15 turns. Heal him on up, and see if we can get in our glorious biowells in Tianga. This raptor bug had the audacity to invade. How dare he? Shinsoku Labs, Glorious, and I approve. Alright, so now we actually get our quest decision. Why didn't I think of this? This is actually quick to four. I'm a dummy. We're gonna switch right on over then. Uh, because I really don't even want that unit yet. Train for labor. 16 affinity, thank you. To work your will is to create your destiny. That's not bad at all. To create a machine to work your will is to create your destiny. Alright, so we're gonna switch this. We only wasted one turn, thankfully. We're gonna pick up cognition right on now. And hope to time our institute with the end of cognition. Then we just kinda you know, cross our fingers, hope we get it early, and pick up a free social dynamics, which is an incredible, incredible tech. One of my favorites. And it looks like time is on up. So we are on the precipice of a glorious events in our uh, little empire here but thank you guys for watching and uh, i will see you guys next time